Tell you what, we don't half bring some kit these days, do we? Well, while I'm here on the 20 foot drain in Cambridgeshire, I'm going to talk you through my top five essential items for tackling natural venues like this. Essential item number one, a good, sturdy, quality platform. You can see here on the 20 foot, we've got really steep banks. We might need to get in the water a little bit. Um, I've got this rigger one here. I've used it for a year or so now. Brilliant piece of kit. I'll come and uh, show you how to set it up. As you can see, it's really windy today. And when we're fishing a pole, you can get a lot better presentation and fish a little bit further out by getting nice and low. So I'm gonna get this platform as low as possible and as stable as possible. Other week I fell in and it was freezing. You don't wanna do that. Another essential item for natural venues is a good ground bait whisk and drill. Today I'm gonna to mix up two or three kilos of ground bait and this will make it a piece of cake. Oh, lovely. Simply lovely. Essential item number three, pole rollers. Now, although these are in vogue at the minute, flat rollers, really good for flat banks, I always carry a good old-fashioned V-roller. Look at him, he's lovely and he? he's about 20 years old, he is. But when you're on steep banks like this, in all seriousness, these are really, really handy. As you can see, massive slope, probably 45 degrees today. You need one of these rollers so you can get it positioned nice and flat behind you, ship back smoothly. It will help you catch more fish. Now I've got a few essential items for this one because I'm going to talk about my old setup. Now when you come on natural venues like this, you're catching a lot of fish really regular. You need to be comfy. I've got a couple of side trays. First is a bit of a bait waiter. That's where I put the bait that I'm feeding really regular. It's right in my hand line so I can pick some bait out and feed it really comfortably. And then I've got a big side tray just at the back of this. And as you can see, I've got my ground bait on here, a few bits and bobs, a disgorger, my hook boxes, and obviously the Tommy Pickering flask. Um, next, a nice roof system. I've got three or four different rigs set up. They're all to hand on my roof so I can pick them up, swap rigs. Got my waggler rod on there, everything's nice and to hand. Also in the setup is my keep net. Now, it's something not a lot of people think about, but I've been fishing with a bit of a whip today, catching loads of little rud, and a few of them dropped off in front of me and have landed in my net, and that's because it's nice and central. Right in front, in the middle of my foot plate, and any little bonus fish that do drop off, you get them extra ounces. Finally, a nice pole sock. We're on a steep bank. The last thing you want is your pole blowing off, rolling in. You don't want to be bending down and picking it up or getting your ends full of mud and stuff. So a nice pole sock. I've got an actual sock and a little clip there. So I've got two little options. And that is a series of essential items, my whole setup. And finally, essential item number five, a long landing net pole. This one is four meters. That is the shortest that I'd use when I come on natural venues. And I've got a little bit of a story to finish off on for this one. When I were a kid, I once fished a national on the Bargate drain at Boston. And I hooked a big tench and it played it up for ages. Played it for about half an hour out in the open water. And I got this tench beat. And as I'm bringing it in, I've only got a little two, two and a half meter landing net pole. And it made one last run. I got it skimming across top and it made one last dive when it were about three meters away from me. Dove into the weeds and I lost it. And that day I know if I'd have had a four meter landing net pole, I'd have got that bonus fish. So when you come on natural venues, they're quite deep. Fish come up quite far out in front of you. You need a long landing net pole to reach them. So that is the final essential item. 